Welcome to Heroes of Dutch Comic Con at Jaarbeurs Utrecht. In the Netherlands. And we're going to walk the entire uh, Comic Con. It's a half hour before opening. Yep, so For the formal opening, because there opening. are VIP tickets available. And those people, the, the VIPs can enter at 9 o'clock, but the fair opens at 10. And we will show you around. So you see some preparations. <coughs> some people are already inside and uh, we'll show you the grounds. Everything you can shop yep. and see and do. And first up, we walk up to the main stage. This is the place where they, at least I saw a fashion show. I'm not sure Fashion about shows, it. interviews, panel discussions. There are also panel discussions on the other side. Yep. Show you that as well. But this is there are some, some of the makers. vendors as well. And of course, the stage. Oh. For from Kianse, Eliza Tyler, Elijah Woods. I think I could be here all day. Oh, yes, definitely. We, we are here all day. Yep. But we're not here all day, not at the main stage. <laughs> no, not at the main stage, because. We're not here as visitors. Not today, no. We are here as vendors. And actually we're here to help a vendor. We're not we have some Dark Steam Park Network merch, but we're basically here to help a friend. We are mainly here to help a friend who sells comics, uh, comics and, um, and graphic novels. And so this is the main stage. It's all the activities. It's very crowded once it's open here. It's yeah, very that, that's the main reason we walk the fair before opening. Yeah, it's. Ooh, let's show this one. Yeah, this is cool. This is so cool. Life size. Tie fighter. So tie fighters and other Star There's Wars. R2D2 over there. Yep. R2D2 also drives around. Morning. And of course, Stormtroopers here as well. The guests of this year, where you can get an autograph, Elijah Wood, Tasha Taylor, Lisa Taylor, Lana Parilla, and Fr From Once. And, and Brainpower is the Dutch rapper. The areas over there is the banner there, an the activities area. We'll show you that as well. The dealer hall we're entering right now. The gaming area, entertainment hall is basically where we are now. Comics area is also something we're going to show you and somewhere we started. Mm -hmm. So let's start at the dealer hall. And this is the hall where you find merch, merch and larger. Here you uh, can spend lots and lots of, oh lots of money. Yeah. Basically shop with us. But we can buy it for you because when you see this vlog we're not here anymore. But Hey, it saves money, right? Show you this way. Oh, all the Disney statues. Oh, I love those. I love those, those Disney statues. Oh, I can't spend so much money here. I didn't see this uh, vendor yesterday. Oh, I love it. Ooh. That's Jafar, your favorite? My favorite, Jafar. But he's not that exclusive, he's here as well. Yeah. There are also lots of sword vendors. People buy a lot of swords too. Mm-hmm. Oh, let's show some statues here too. Oh, I like this statue. Yeah, oh, yeah, the Walt Disney statue. The Walt Disney statue, oh wow. And there's a Gremlin statue even. That's a lot I told you, Gremlin is still popular. Yeah. Oh, we need the pool is cute. Yep. That is so cute. Look at that with the boot. Mm -hmm. And like I said, lots of lots of swords to buy. <coughs> Let's go over and, and just circle a bit. I'm not really into swords myself, but you can really shop your heart out if you are. And of course, Dutch Heroes of the Comic Con is 
a bi-yearly adventure. Uh, no, uh, no, twice a year. Twice a year. It's twice a year. There's a summer edition and a winter edition. And this is, of course, because we're in November, this is the winter edition. Also, Disney, Disney bags, lots of mm. Disney bags. Let's take a peek inside. Show the center off. It's Christmas ornaments as well. I, I loved the, uh, the Santa Mickey that's over there and the Santa oh, yeah. Stitch. And the Santa Yoda. They have 20% off of all Star Wars Christmas ornaments. Of course they do. It's a lesson, right? If you're going to come and come bring enough money, save up. Or you're gonna be here wanting lots of stuff and... Have to make hard decisions. Yep. Because lots of vendors do have special, special prices. There's special Lego prices mm -hmm. here as well. Lots of jewelry also for sale. Oh, some comics here as well. Yep, there uh, is a comic area, but for yeah. one reason or another, not all vendors are there. Not all vendors are concentrated in the comic area, but also in the dealer area. Which I don't know why. No, it's confusing. I think that ca they can do that better. Oh, if you want food and drinks. And Funkos. And Funkos. Funkos. Mainly Funkos, but also a lot of other food and beverage items. More comics, so. which again is weird. Oh, and there are also lots of posters here. I think I'm going to do this one because <laughs> yesterday I think I saw some very cute posters over there. Oh, there are some old film posters over here. Pinocchio is very old. Mm -hmm. But it's huge. Oh, and you can buy the Lord of the Rings to sign, of course, by the Hedge Book. That's smart. Of course. <laughs> oh, no. It's now up. There are lots of Lego. Yesterday I saw a stormtrooper with a head like that. Mm -hmm. That was very funny. Oh, bookmarks. Oh, love those. Oh, they're cool drawings. That's really an artist. Mm -hmm. Bookmarks. Nice one. Tie dyes. And statues. Harry Potter shop. Over there. Again, swords, lots and lots of swords, bags, tails. Ah, here we go. There's two owls up actually. And he, he or she isn't here yet, but I love those travel posters. To the Shire, Mordor, Hot. Midgard. That's cool. Really nice style. And I love this community because it's fun. People are really themselves. It's very peaceful, but I, I it's also a community that loves to read. And loves to create themselves. Yeah, create a community. Because this is the, uh, the author himself selling books. And yeah. I, there is actually a complete area with makers. And they sell we'll show all you later. We'll show you later, so stay tuned. Uh, and they sell all things they made themselves. Uh, these are basically the commercial vendors. Mm -hmm. So you see lots of Disney, Lego, and again, lots and lots of the same. And again, well, of course, I can imagine Disney you bags. love it. Of course, I love it. But the creative community is basically everything handmade or hand designed. So they're unique pieces.
posters. We're not going to show you every owl because we'll... Go, oh, then we'll be walking for hours. Yeah, and we're needed at stand, so we can't walk for hours over here. So. If you like it, you have to visit. There is a summer event and a winter event. But we promise to show you all areas. So yeah, we will. Oh, we will. stay tuned. We're going to show you lots more. But I can imagine the other areas we just crossed by. Well, you can just if show you, you around, but not every aisle, every no. vendor. Gives you peaks at aisles. But there's lots of not the same stuff to do here. Let's walk up to the end and then up into the front. Yeah. Let's look at the size of this hall. And this is only one of the halls. Yeah. This is the, the biggest event, right? The, the, this there is, is a Comic Con in Amsterdam. Yep. Oh, I love that one. The Chucky doll. One. Oh, that, that's just creepy. <laughs> There's also, uh, yesterday I saw, and she's still there, an Annabelle oh. doll. 500 but euros, life-size Annabelle doll. To keep that in your house, it's like, oh, <laughs> I wouldn't, I wouldn't sleep anymore. A small chicky doll. It surprises me that not all vendors are here yet. It's like 10 minutes before opening now. Mm, 20. Oh, 20. Okay. 20. But. I think it's a pity because you sell VIP tickets yeah. to persons for early access. And you need to have it all available, right? Yeah, and now you have VIP entrance to a, f a fair that's building up. And not everyone is already vending their stuff. And I think that's a pity. Well, yeah. I didn't hear anyone complain, so I'm sure it's all right. Ooh, the Bobaton hats. Lightsabers, of course, and lots of stuffed animals. And I'm not sure if it's because of Lightyearwood, but there are a lot of Lord of the Rings. I thought the year we visited it was less. But we visit the other event oh, right. in Amsterdam. Yeah. This year quite popular is Loki. Yep. We saw lots of Lokis. Star Trek also. Star Trek is uh, Star Trek, Star Wars are always popular IPs for cosplaying and of course the Harry Potters. Yeah, lots of Harry Potters. Ah, there are some board games. Not that much. There are some. <laughs> oh, I love the animal statue. Animal. That's cute. But there aren't that much board games, and I'm really into... Oh, here's the other one. This oh, is the yes. poster vendor. Also not here yet. Also the same sort of style. Yeah, I, it's also very commercial, of course. So, when you buy this, you don't have an original print, but it is a cool print. But as I said, uh, there aren't that much board games, and I think that's a pity. I love board games. <laughs> yeah. But I can't imagine, because, well, they take up a lot of places. Let's walk here. I thought we would take this out, but we'll take the next one. Also, lots of mystery bags. Go 
good way to sell stuff you otherwise won't. <laughs> True. But mainly fun. So and that was the dealer area. I'm gonna leave the dealer area right now. Oh, I love that dome. The Cheshire cat. Oh, I thought the stitch one. No, yeah, that's cool, but the Cheshire cat. We're all mad here. We can take that one home if you want to. <laughs> yes. Oh, well, we might. I'm all for not taking yourself too seriously. Well, let's talk about the food here. The food here is good, good mm -hmm. quality. Yep. Um, expensive but though. Uh, We've got <laughs> as on any fair, uh, a flat a flatbread is up to 10 euros. Yeah, and it's uh, like a mini pizza. A hot dog, 8 euros. And there are long lines. You can bring your own food. Mm -hmm. um, so that's a choice. And there is not that much choice in food. No. Because most of the food is distributed. Distribute. <laughs> it's brought to you <laughs> by the Abers <coughs> itself. And if you really need a seat half to, uh, through the day, you might want to uh, pull up a piece of floor. Buy a, a VIP ticket because then you have your own VIP yeah. area. The VIP with area seating. has enough seating, but every other place is packed, jam packed. So you need to wait for a seat or mm -hmm. pull up a piece of floor and just sit out on the floor. Oh, Groot and Rocket. This is the cinema area, and they've got some cool statues you can take a photo with. Over here, there's a school. Showing off. Grafse Lyceum Rotterdam. Donald Duck, still the most popular magazine in the Netherlands. And are we going to the uh, and actually, yeah, yeah, we just walk yeah. up. But actually, we're the only country in the world where Donald Duck magazine is the most popular magazine in the country. Really? Yeah. Oh, oh this one is also so nice to show you. The diorama builders. Yeah, they're really good. In America, they don't have the, ma uh, the weekly magazine. Oh. Yeah, I knew that, but I thought the rest of Europe would have a no. popular Donald Duck. No. no? Netherlands and some places in Norway, uh, in uh, Scandinavia. Oh, this is a very cool Wolverine. You can get it uh, for yourself. Of course. Only 1900 euros. Like I said, my paintings aren't that expensive. But you can get piercings and tattoos. And when you think, oh, cosplaying as the army is very popular, no, the army has a stand here. You Let's go into the Asian area first. Yeah, you can work at our army and there. The bubble teas. The bubble teas. Yep. And I like this as well. Oh, really? Uh, it's like you're in Asia. Well, we're going to have to experience that ourselves because we're going to Japan. But they are here. The onigiri for 13 euros or for 50 50 you have onigiris and a drink. I don't not even know what it is, but. Ah. And here is, uh, we talk a lot about this guy. Yeah, we talk this a lot about This is the him. stand of uh, the child book author Paul van Loon. And, and he is here to uh, sign. We talk a lot about him because he... He writes books for the afternoon. And, and all four books are here because there is the Smokes Club. And of course many, many other books. And I think it's cool, he's here to sign himself. There's an interview with him every day. Yeah. So now you see, we don't only say it, he's famous, he actually is famous. <laughs> We've proven ourselves. It's not only because we like him. You know, you buy a kimono. 
And here we go over to the experience area. With, of course, a star stand from Disney Star Channel. But they also have their own theater over there. So let's walk up there. Oh, also board games. Game Mania says they have board games. I have to check that out later. They have also Lego. And they couldn't get the real Aquaman, so they've got a statue of Aquaman. Well, why not? Well, it's... Look at him. Statue. Person. It's a good statue. No, it's not. Statue. Person. Person is much better looking. Come on. Oh. So, this is made out of Lego. Completely. Yeah, how cool. They've this is so cool. And he actually moves. Uh, not right I don't now. know if we can see it now, but... And they've got the mini version you can buy over there. How cute is that? It's a Lego set, but I really, really like this Lego set. Yeah. So, let's take a peek in. Oh no. Yeah. They do sell Funkos and Legos over here. And for example, the Bowser set is almost 90 euros cheaper than in the Lego store itself. So it's really your money where to buy it here and even sell it online. Uh. Of course, most people that love Lego are here, so I'm not sure how much good that would do, but it is a good deal. It's a very it's good deal. It's a good deal. Here is the Nintendo stand. You can play the new Super Mario Wonder. It's a fun game. Mario now can turn into an elephant. Yep. Oh, and you have a picture spot in the green pipeline. There is a gaming area over there. This is mainly a gaming area where you can experience all the games yourself, buy them, but mostly experience it. And that's what I like about Comic Con. There's a lot to experience. Yeah, you, it's two days. It's a Saturday and a Sunday. A lot of people come those two, those two days. Because I get it. If you want to experience everything, then two days is necessary. Yeah, you need to spend two days. And here is the Red Bull Gaming Ground with the eSports. It's a gaming stage yeah. where they do contests. This is a Formula One simulation area. For example, there's lots to do here. This is the end of this part. Yep. So we turn around here again. Also some food over there, some poffertjes. That's a local little pancake. Oh, and the army actually has two places. Yep. Wow. Here you can experience it. Yeah, sure. I'm not too big a fan because I know how much I pay for such a stand. And I think that's a lot of government money, but hey. <sighs> but actually, we need it if we look at Ukraine right now. Yeah. Let's 
fighting is ever a solution, but yeah, well. It's never a solution, but well, there are people who think it's a good idea to pick other la people's lands. Let's not go there. No. Let's do it. We don't want to make this a political vlog, it's just showing you around Comic Con. Yeah, and if you're worried about that, it's, it's so much negative energy. Yeah. And this fair is so much fun. Yeah. Well, if we walk up over there, we probably make it to show you the opening of the ah, cool. of the day. And that's something. Yeah. We watched it yesterday. People pile up in front of the gates. So everything from now has only been accessible by VIPs. And those are just special passes you can buy. It's not like you have to be handpicked for something. You just need to pay some extra and you're a VIP. And you get some uh, really nice extras. Yeah, like VIP area, lockers, like a goodie bag, early access. Actually some food, I believe you get some coffee and... Uh... Coffee, yep. So I like that a lot. I think it's a good thing they offer such a solution. Absolutely, but what we're going to see now is the official opening. So everybody who bought a regular ticket... They can, can enter at 10. Oh, they have Lokan. This is Lokana here. The new trading game. It's ah. a trading game. Hi. Hi. And we didn't talk about that. You talk, said something about the community, but it's really a fun place to be because everybody is happy. It's nice to each other. Uh, you can be whoever you want to be. We saw a very special moment yesterday at the <laughs> Spider Man meeting yeah. for the first time. <laughs> And what I also liked was the, the the Princess Peach. Yeah. A one meter eighty high male, firmly built, dressing and up like Princess Peach, and I loved it. Yeah. He, he owned it. And a it. good costume. Yeah. And uh, that's what I love as well. People spent so much time and energy in that costume. We saw uh, actually a real life Chewbacca. You could have fooled me. He was real life. Mm -hmm. Ah, this is a mini escape room. Ah, the diner. The that looks scary. Four digits, two minutes. <laughs> Lovely. Yep. They're piling up. Only oh, four there months. There is. There is Chewbacca. <laughs> Fighting side by side. I want a picture too. You want a picture? Yeah, I want a picture too. You want to? Then you have to pause the vlog for a moment, or just squeeze in if you want to. Just start again. Here we go. Oh, and talking about cool costumes, wow. <laughs> I love it. Oh, there's R2D2. Like, uh, let me turn around. Sorry, and we can walk up there in mi just a minute. Yep. Within a couple of minutes, the doors open. Oh, you've got lots of stormtroopers here to guide everything in the right direction. Of course, that's what stormtroopers do, right? Oh, there's T-Rex there too. Lots of T-Rexes. It's a T-Rex <laughs> meeting today, I cool. guess. But I'm not sure you see that on camera. What I love about this area is we haven't shown you yet, we'll walk right through when uh, the doors open. But this area is all about like the, the fandoms, the communities. We've got the Ghostbuster community. Oh, right there, over there. 
and we've got the Star Wars community, Star Trek community. It's all about cosplaying and finding your community. Lightsaber sports. The doors open and they have to hold them up for two more minutes. I'm not sure if they want, they will. And as you can see, people just wait. Yeah, they don't push in. It's such a fun community. I have a fun talk to the security officer. Just fun. And if you take it up, it goes straight in front of it to show you around. Oh, I see Spider-Man as well. There are, are a lot of Spider-Mans. Countdown started. Here we go. Captain America. <coughs> Pikachu, elves, Pokemon, SWAT teams. Final girls. Oh, there's Jesus and, uh, again. And, uh, this is not a Jesus. There Which was a Jesus with a sign yesterday. It was not a Jesus. He and said, if you need a sign, this is it. Personally, one of my favorite costumes of the day. <laughs> and here we go. Let's show you around this area. Ooh. Oh, wow. I love this Mandalorian. Box. No, Boba Fett. Mando, Boba Fett. All these stormtroopers. I, that goes. Ghostbusters meeting. <laughs> and I love it, people Stormtroop. just don't go here. If stormtroops are there, people go out of the way. <laughs> That's like perfect, right? Yep. Here in it just really, works. They really block it that nobody can through. And not because... Oh, oh only God. one. <laughs> yeah. it. But look at this. Yeah. They all made it themselves, and I love it. That's here. So good. entire Ghostbuster stand here. It's a community. They've got so much cool stuff. The Doctor Who community. And the Harry Potter community, of course, we've got a TARDIS here. With a cool sign. Did you see the sign over here? Mm -hmm. TARDIS parking only. Nope, I didn't saw it. Love that. I love it. Let's show you R2D2. I, uh, he's driving around, I guess. The Green Hornet. Because <laughs> here's a Star Wars community with all the droids. the terrifier look at these and they do actually drive and they've got droid handlers so they drive for all around the fair and they're so good and now I think the last stop we show you the makers. The makers, and then we're already back to our own stand. Yes, and we're gonna work all day. Up till but six o'clock, and then. On the best workplace there is. Oh, for sure. Every time you look up, there's a new fun character to see. 
a nice dog to make. I love working here. Yeah, there so are lots of... Oh, let me show you the signing area. Oh, there's so a signing the area from... The artist, the drawer. The comic artist. Yes. And here you have the maker's area. We we'll just zigzag this because... I like it. I like people who make their own stuff. Show it around. Show it off and, of course, sell it. Try to, yeah. So you've got everything here. You've got magnets, you've got buttons, you've got pins, drawings, posters, postcards, stickers. Commission work. Socks. Mugs. Book layers. Stuffed animals. Book layers are popular, I saw. Yeah? And I like that. Because books are popular in this community. Let's go back. Walk back. Yeah. Just show everything off. Oh, bookmarks. I got the wrong word. Bookmarks. Not book layers, bookmarks. Bookmarks. Tote bags. The reader. Keychains. Hello. Hello. Earrings. No and then I try to film around cosplayers, but why? They no want to don't. show the they, they wanted to show their costumes. Oh, it's completely baroque. Like every stand here has its own style. It's like inspired by something like this. Is really inspired by Harry Potter. She's got nifflers, but very much her own design. And still now it's 10 o'clock, not every vendor is yeah, well, already open. Some makers do have some timing issues, of course. That's why they probably or need, makers. <laughs> or need to rest. Because yeah. it was a long oh, day yesterday. It was a very long day yesterday. And it's going to be a long day today. There's a cozy area where there are smaller panel discussions yes and more uh, about the artists so they're showing off how they draw the flip overs there and how long it takes for them to make a drawing how the process is it's they're cool discussions and this is the comic area one of the more quiet areas of the fair yeah but when you are here and professor x is here come say hello to us next time you'll probably be there too and I think this is a, that is the stand where we end this video. Yes, there you can see my paintings, we, we, which are not expensive at all. They are not <laughs> expensive, and if you're not able to join us here, of course you can't, because you see this after. You can also buy online at dutchteamparknetwork.com slash shop. Yeah. So, there's Professor X. Well, say goodbye, and we bye say bye. wave goodbye, and we say goodbye to you as well. So, yes. see you in the next one. <laughs>